and tell them about the Lord. <laughs> Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. <laughs> All right, my God. <laughs> Do you wrong? <laughs> if I'm in person, I'll give me eat it wrong. So, we're here with Shakio, Nicole Gun, Chaz, Rabbit, <laughs> Orisha, 6K, Neil Day from Neil Day TV, Princess Rochelle, of course, <laughs> Avoid me, Chaz, JD or, or JD for short, Urbisha, Joanna Williams. I'm Selenia. Does shape matter? Yes. Why? You want to have something you can grab on, you know? Something that you can fill up. You see me? <laughs> yeah, boy. So you say big boobs, big this and big that? Big breasts. You have to have big breasts. Yeah. Something big. I'm not really worried so much about the ass, but we can work with it, right? But once you have big breasts, yeah, man. I'm going to chat to her. So you say you want everything just like how KC do it? Me no mind everything. Every, if, if she has everything, good also. Yeah. First question, right? If you walk in a supermarket and you only have $100 in your wallet, right? Yeah. Which one of the two you don't buy? A pack of condom or cash pot? Cash pot, because I can make more money. If me win, it adds if me win. So you know, your coffee new song locked down yeah, and, 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 your, and your girl their own and thing, you know, go sick of your condom. I do it wrong. <laughs> if I'm in person, I'll give me eat it wrong. Why? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 the kid is not a bad doctor. I don't know, Aaron. If I can make more money, I would take a chance to make more money. You see me? Does shape matter? No. Somewhat. For a male or a female? Uh, yeah, look at relationship and stuff, you know, your type. Oh, your te yeah, your type. No, shape, no. So you say big head and small body? Doesn't matter. <laughs> big head, small head, <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> right? Mm. You're going to a supermarket and you only have $100 in your wallet, right? Mm. Out of these two items, which one you, would you buy? Mm -hmm. A condom, a pack of condom, or cash pot? Um. Cash pot. Why? Would I buy a cash pot? Because um, there's a possibility of me winning and losing. Uh, with a condom, if I buy a condom, I'm not sex, that doesn't make no sense. <laughs> so, we might win something with the cash pot, so I might as well try the cash pot. Alright, so we have some questions, some tricky questions I want to ask you today. Yeah. So, alright, first one, right? Mm -hmm. If you wake up tomorrow and your cock job dead, what would you use? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Listen. Say if you wake up tomorrow, right? Yeah. And your cock job dead, what would you use? You don't understand that question, eh? You understand that, bro? Wait, wait, wait. If you wake up tomorrow, mm -hmm. and your I'm cock, cock job dead, dead, what would I use? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what book, uh, hold on. What would I use? What would I use, do I? In a relationship. What? No man, me, every morning I wake dog, me, me, me hold but, always a shoot up in the sky. Yeah, you see me? Every morning. Every, every morning, always oh, like, you see me? Stiff like me? steel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy. Every day for side. Yeah, man, yeah, man. Yeah, you can't drop your man. Every morning. It's just that a, no so it's good. It's just a nature thing that morning yeah. time. Yeah. Always. For real, man. But you know, you know what I'm saying? I don't mean, though. What you mean? You understand? What you mean? <laughs> if your rooster drop dead, you understand? Where do you use your alarm clock? You understand? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you get what I'm saying? You walk in a supermarket and you only have $100, right? Out of the two, which one would you buy? A pack of condom or a cash pot? <laughs> you know, $100 a condom? 
I just assume say on jedala on jedala for your pack can. You need the condom? Yeah, but you can. She said she need the condom. Me ask like Wait. Exactly. Me I keep my money. Even we carry the condom. I'm in the buy cash part. Me I keep my own jedala. Exactly. Me buy one bottle of water. Well, I don't partake in those things, oh, <laughs> so uh. <laughs> so I'm not gonna buy any of the above, you know. So you go wrong. You go wrong. You know, I don't partake, you know. I'm more say, of a marriage type, you know. Same question. Yeah. Me not buy none of them. Me might buy the cash part, might, maybe. Buy, which number you that way? But yeah, go on. Which number you that way? Because. <laughs> Whosoever you gonna have sex with must have condoms. Yeah. You walk in a supermarket, you only have hundred dollar left in your wallet, right? Mm-hmm. Out of these two items, which one would you buy? A pack of condom or a cash pot? None. Why not? They're about not. Mm. A pack of condom or a what? Cash pot. What is cash pot? Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Get out of here, man! Lottery? Yes. None. See ya. But you're broke, man, and you know, nothing. You, you, you tell me I have $100, right? Yes. I wouldn't buy any. I don't need them. Yeah. But you can multiply and win little money with the, with the cash pot, you know, so, you know? But the cash pot is gambling. You don't know. Listen, when it comes to gambling and lottery, you you hardly ever win, so why am I going to buy it? Yeah. The next question, right? If you have only one hundred dollar in your purse, right, and you're walking at the supermarket, water one condom, and one or cash pot, which one would you buy? Water. <laughs> <laughs> condom or cash pot? Like cash pot, condom. What am I do with one condom, dog? What am I do with cash pot? Not buy cash pot. If you have to choose one, which one? Cash pot. Why? Because when I look funny, you know, if I buy one condom now, without one ring, and engage in a sexual activities, then I break a law. And I gamble, I still a break a law. So which one of them I got to break and repent? The gambling. The gambling. Call to gamble every day. With life. So the next question is, right? Does in a relationship, right? You are seek a partner. Does shape matter? Shape, no. Like you go look for one man shape, then you can ask that. No. no. Sometimes woman have your alright. What is your type then? Yeah, what your preference? Male. Dark skin, dark skin tall. You have a body and then something. <laughs> where you say muscles? Where you say one Hulk? Yes. Cars. Cars. What do you mean? <laughs> when you say tall, you mean. Alright, you. Not you. Alright, you give your opinion. It must be I will say everything and in cash, right? It must be tall. Either tall like me or tall. <laughs> yeah, boy. So you have a little body. Yeah. A little look. No, no, good man. So you say heavy, heavy. And I like, I like dark skin. You know, one of brown man. Okay. <laughs> yes, yes, that's that's basically it. So does size matter? Size, yeah, definitely. Size matters. No, shape. I mean, shape. Does shape matter? <laughs> oh, shape. <laughs> oh, yeah. Of course, what shape matters. <laughs> shape matters. No? All right, all right. As much as you go back to the personality and everything, you know, like males more attracted to a certain type of female. You get me? The thicker the female be, the more attractive we are to them. You get me? You yeah, see me? So, would I work with a skinny girl? Yes, but me have to be some attraction. Would I go for thickers? You get me? Probably, you, you kind of fall in that category. <laughs> you see me? Light skin. No, no, me have something with light skin. No, no. Alright. Yeah, you give my vibe, you know, light skin. Glasses, too. <laughs> <laughs> if you walk into the supermarket, right, and you only have $100 in your wallet, right, which one of the two items 
which one of these items would you buy, right? A pack of condom or cash pot? What's the cash pot? Gambling man, your place a number, you know. Yeah, your place a little bit pan a number, and then if your number call, you win a little money and thing. Yeah. Cash pot. I get a cash pot. Why? Uh, I'm, I'm a businessman, quote unquote. So, I take gambles on a daily basis, if you know what I mean. In a relationship, right? Does shit matter? Does shit matter? Mm -hmm. In our relationship. Yeah. The, the woman shit matter, bro. Yeah. Yeah, it matter. I feel matter, you know, because we don't want, want no more girl. We don't want a playboard. Yes, we don't want, you know, want, want no girl. And we don't want a girl who have too much bone. Because yeah, we don't bone, you know, we want some of <laughs> flesh. Because two bone and two bone have been up together. Too much gas in. Too much gas in. <laughs> yeah, boy. Is it me? Yeah. KFC. KFC. You like them like KFC? Well, me, KFC, I don't like them like KFC, no, so I'm not like eating KFC. thing. Boy! I don't like them shape. Shape, full of shape like geometry set. Yeah. So you don't say heavy? Yeah, yeah. Heavy, yeah, heavy. heavy. You know when cement wet up? Yeah. yeah heavy. And then I book it. <laughs> same, so. Does shape matter in a relationship? What? If you look at a girl, right, does shape matter? It's not priority, but somewhat. So, if it is that you don't have anything around the back, like it doesn't matter to me. So yeah. what what kind what type of girls are like? You like them thick or slim? No preference. Not really. No. But uh, if I was to choose thick, yeah. You yeah, say so you like them heavy, heavy. <laughs> eh? Yeah. All right then. So, next question is right. If you walk in a supermarket and you only have one hundred dollar in your wallet, right? Right. Which one of these items would you buy? A pack of condom or cash pot? Cash pot. Why? Cause I have a chance of increasing my money. So if it is that I need to buy condoms and I need more money, buying cash pot can help me get more money. So it's a win win. So you're the test condom? No. Just cash pot. You walk in another store, a supermarket, right? Mm -hmm. And you only have 100 dollars in your purse, right? Which one of these two items would you buy? Right? Would you buy a pack of condom or a cash pot? <laughs> I don't know the answer to that either because I don't do both of those things. But hypothetically, I buy the cash pot. Why? You have a chance of winning money. Alright, suppose you're not win. Then so be it. If you had only $100 in your purse, right? Mm -hmm. Which one would you buy? Cash pot or a pack of condom? Why? So that stick is still in the camera, I'd went to soon, you know, so we don't gamble. You know, so we can't have sex outside of marriage, okay, from once. So I go, go buy a condom, I don't know, so I go, walk with the team. You know what I mean? But, I don't that, me that, me that try with the cash pot still. And then go pray after, you see me? Okay, you know, so I spend it on July, I can't probably, probably double up that, you see me? So, I just do maths. <laughs> so you say cash pot is a better option right now? Of course, now. of course. Money we are free, you know? <laughs> now it's not, now that's right. <laughs> Does shape matter? Shape? I mean, like triangle and them things there. Alright, in a relationship, does shape matter? Well, it depends. It depends on what you like. Yeah, so, but I say yes. If you have a preference, if you like your girl round or if you like your girl slim, it all depends. Yeah. So, what type of girls do you like? Every girl, I have a preference. I have a preference. Once I'm attracted to you, I'm attracted to you. Whether you're red, yellow, black, or white, all are precious in his sight. Yeah, man. Does shape matter? What? Does shape matter? Shape. Yeah. Shape does matter because everybody have a type. You mightn't like some skinny girl or you mightn't like a fat girl. Everybody have their preference. I think like shape matter. So if he, so if he's slim, 
Right on your head big like balloon. You don't date him same way? No. <laughs> no. Um my type is probably like built guys. Not not muscly, but built guys, um, tall and good personality. And yeah. Does shit matter? Nah. Does shape matter in a relationship? Shape? Like how she looks and how I look? If you look a girl, right? Does shape matter? Yes. Why? Uh, it's a good indicator of how well you take care of your body. And if you take care of your body, you can probably take care of more important, not more important stuff, but small things that contribute to the relationship. So, what, what involves in nice shape? What kind of girl you like? You like them big, slim, trim, like light posts over this are oh you like them my ideal girl is slim thick and gets in the gym to stay that way so you say if she flat you want her see him way if she's flat yeah throw out here in the back yeah nah i don't know about that <laughs> <laughs> slim thick so slim up here mm -hmm. thick in the back and the legs you only had one hundred dollar in your purse, right? And you're walking at the supermarket. Which one of these two items would you buy? A pack of condom or a cash pot? What's a cash pot? Wow, well, gambling. Not, I'm not from here. <laughs> it's gambling. You win little money and you know your place a bit time for that oh, number. Yeah, that then. Mm -hmm. Cash pot. That's Why? Um, so I could try and win money. You the test the condom? No, no, no. We're Christians here. Hey, yeah. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Um, <laughs> I wouldn't test with the condom. <laughs> no. Gotta get some money, yeah. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Does shit matter? You talking about maths or physics? Something all right. Something all right, yeah. Relationship, does shape matter? I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> uh, for like to guys, for women, I'm just gonna yeah. assume, yeah. Um, well, guys are physical creatures. They always say the first thing they look at is looks. So, but it depends on the guy. I don't think it always matter. It depends on the guy, cause like some guys they don't really care, and then some guys like you have to have a shape. So it depends on the guy. Yeah. So what type of guys you like? I like Christian guys, but I keep attracting players. I don't know. I, it's of Satan. It's not good. Um, yeah. I like I like Christian guys. I like guys that are respectful and have manners, have a relationship with God. You know? Yeah. If you have a hundred dollar loan in your wallet, right? And you're walking at the supermarket, which one would you buy? A pack of condom or cash pot? I buy a cash pot. I can win back off a cash pot. <laughs> yeah, boy. I can turn my hundred dollar in a million dollars. I buy the cash pot. So you're not, you're not supposed to not win? Then I say, guys, a 50 50 chance. Why one pack of condom? Why possibilities when I go get back out of one pack of condom? Can't get all if a girl. But my cash pot can't get me money. Why can't make me get all if a girl same way? Does shape matter? I mean, to a point, you don't go on one girl with straight like a broomstick or a shape like book cover. You go on a girl with little curls, with little ass, with little breasts. Because this end of the day, you know, one day with one girl and you walk and somebody see you and think a two man walk. But she have to have personality. Charisma, she have to have a little brains. Huh? So everything have to matter. Everything matter. You, you only have 100 dollars in your wallet, right? Mm -hmm. And you go into the supermarket. Which one would you buy? A pack of condom or a cash pot? Cash pot. If you don't have a number, you don't stand a chance. That would I buy, cash pot. So, <laughs> <laughs> cash pot is a better option. Cash pot is a better option, of course. Your girlfriend come home every night and I give you a bun. Would you take it? 
Come on, even as I give me bun. Then I take it. Boy, I'm a tell you. If she come home. I don't take no bun for no woman yeah. because you know, my woman supposed to cook dinner. I don't want a bun for you. I don't want a bread. A dumpling and bombardos <laughs> cook food more in my system. So if she come on and I give me a bun every night, I don't take that. So if she come home and I give me a bun every night, mm -hmm. if you don't take it. I don't know that one there, go. Come home and I give me a bun. Like, well, like, bun. Bun for eat. I must bun for eat. Bun for eat. Cut. Bun, you bon, bon. you know my love. Come on, come on, man, give me a bun. Mm -hmm. She can't give me a bun when come she on, come man, home. Come on, man, give me a bun. If she not come in, yeah. You see me, sir? So she not give me the, nothing. The only way I take it out when you have a bun with a brief cream, and she can't give me a bun yeah. when she come in. Come on, man, bun for dinner. Cook food, man. You see me, you see me, I say. Let's say them a G. Yeah. All right, with G. Just big up yourself. And you, you want to shout out your Instagram or your YouTube? Yeah, man. You don't know, say so you're 6K TV. And you can go on YouTube and check out 6K TV. And on um, Instagram and roll really 6K. Kawa, I'm out. <laughs> don't know Neela J TV on the YouTube. Follow me on Instagram, Neela J underscore official. Same, man. So, you only have $100 in your wallet, right? Oh. You're walking at the supermarket. Which one would you buy? Would you buy cash pot or a pack of condom? Cash pot. Why? Come I might might win a more money than the hundred dollars I'm spent on it. I'm not working, so I'm not buying no condom. <laughs> I want the box of the one this so. Repeat that one. Me have everything, so I'm not buying no condom. If you have hundred dollar in your purse, the last hundred dollar, right? Which one out of the two would you buy? Cash pot? Or a pack of condom. Cash pot. Cash pot. Why? Abstain, guys. <laughs> Abstinence makes sense. You don't need a condom. Go get the cash pot out to God see you win the million dollars here. So you say cash pot are better? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. If you only had a hundred dollar in your purse, right? Yeah. Which one would you buy? A pack of condom or cash pot? None. <laughs> None. Oh. Well, cash pot, you maybe will win, but you maybe lose. Um, condom now, you know, for Christian, so you carry it. You could do nothing with it. So, I want a rough, so I want a sticky. But it's probably cash what? Yeah. Just shout out your Instagram. Sorry, Jojo underscore Marie Williams. You're walking in a supermarket and the only thing you have a hundred dollar. Or maybe one fifty. Mm -hmm. You understand? What which one out of the two would you buy? A pack of condom or cash pot? Well, you know, as a man of God, you know. We don't buy, we would just probably buy a, a juicy fruit, you know, or a spearmint, you know, we wouldn't, yeah, we wouldn't involve ourselves in those malicious activities. Yes, I. <laughs> Say, oh, the gay cash pot I try. Mm, no, I mean, I think so. I mean, I think I'm lucky. <laughs> I mean, I think I'm lucky. So, if your if your girlfriend come over, you do better, you buy a condom. Brother, as I said, as a man of God, you know. YouTube world, Abstin anti uh, abstinence makes sense. You see me? Trust me. Genesis 1 verse 1. Abstinence makes sense. Uh, you have 100 dollars in your wallet left, right? Mm -hmm. And you're going at a supermarket, right? Which one of these would you buy? Would you buy cash pot or a pack of condom? Well, because a uh, hundred dollars can purchase a pack of condoms. I think it's one hundred and fifty dollars for it. So um, I'm, I'm not sure. <laughs> I, I've never purchased cash pot before. I don't gamble. So, so which one would you buy? If the cash pot is well, serious, no, no, because I don't think you can afford either of them. But cash pot, I would have a chance to win more, I guess. If they would break um some spiritual law, well not spiritual law, Christian law, so cash pot. You go for Instagram. Um, Rabbit World for Instagram, and you can find me at Rahim Betty on YouTube. 
you want me you want but tell a two a two yeah they do want me to say <laughs> it's two. <laughs> All right, so you can tell them a little bit, you know, where you do on your YouTube channel, and you can boss, you can give me a little piece. Well, right now my voice kinda <laughs> gone, but um, I do a little singing on YouTube, so you can find me there. Mm. Yeah, me can't really sing right now. <laughs> you saying I'm gee girl or nothing? No, sad. I can tell them about the Lord. <laughs> Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. <laughs> All right, my God. <laughs> All right, my G, do you want to show out your Instagram? Um, Orisha Spence, H-O-R-A-T-I-O Spence. No, no underscore, no dot, no nothing, just that. So do you want to show out your Instagram? Um, what is my Instagram name? Lady Ann. Um, yeah. Follow me. I might not follow back, but follow me. Yeah, make sure so you check out Lady Ann here. Yeah? <laughs> All right. Lady Ann said, <laughs> Yes, just like and, Chinese. And I'm there, like, thinking so hard, like, oh, no, wait, what? 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 It's two. Yeah, right. it got me good. It got me good. <laughs>